G'day, Paul here from Rotec Aerosport. We're here at Sun and Fun just packing up. And this gentleman here, his name is Chris. Chris May. Chris May, and he's been flying a Piper J3 Cub on floats for some time now. He's just come up and uh, had a chat with us about these TBIs. And uh, Chris, I, I understand, we're just gonna do a quick chat, have a quick chat about how he's going. Um, somewhat of a, te a video testimony. Chris here, you got 650 hours, you were saying? 650 hours on my uh, experimental J3 Cub that I run on uh, some amphibious floats. Uh, built it in 2001, been flying all this time. The entire 650 hours, never had a single hiccup with this throttle body at all. It's, it's run flawlessly all that, the time. That's wonderful, Chris. Now, Chris, am I right in saying you've got the O200 on this cup? Yes. And you're using the TBI 40-3, which is uh, the same as this unit here. That's correct. And Chris has basically been uh, saying that the unit's been working flawlessly, 650 hours. He's just dropped by the booth and picked up a seal kit. He doesn't actually need it now, but he'll be using it in the future. So um, so there you go, 650 hours, trouble free, right? No trouble, issues? Trouble free, no issues. If something happened, I'd buy another one today. And tell me, what are some of the what are jet going on? What are the advantages you found with the unit, Chris? Uh, the problems we always had with the Stromberg prop, uh, carburetors system, other than the floats and trying to get them to from the idle jet to the to the main jet, where this is just flawless. At whatever setting you set the, the throttles at, it's just seamless. When you add the power in, there's there's no hesitation, no hiccup. Uh, the nice thing about it is you idle with the thing for five minutes, taxing out. When you add power, it's not overloaded. The engine is just is responsive right off the bat. And, and so, goes. even with the absence of an accelerator pump, which sometimes concerns people, you find that the acceleration is quite quite it's, good. It's just fine. I uh, just use gravity feed with the, the tank that's that's uh, you know in the fuselage, like the normal J3 Cubs. Plenty of uh, head pressure. It takes off and goes. And tell me about the setup. As soon as, aside from you having to obviously organise your mixture cable and your throttle cable, was there much to actually tuning it in and dialing it in? Uh, no, there wasn't anything. Just uh, you know, a couple of minor adjustments to mixture control mainly on the idle uh, adjustment on that, and then I made sure that the uh, that the throttle cable, you know, would hit your stops before you know I had full travel. Yes. You know, the normal things that you would do. But. Actually, that's a very important point. What Chris is describing there is that he's not relying on the throttle body's roll pins as stops. He's making sure that his quadrant and his controls actually hit a stop before they start to, uh, you know bend or you know put excessive load on the units themselves so that's a very valid point yeah, the uh, these uh, throttle bodies are a quarter inch shorter than the Stromberg carburetor so if you use the, the regular air boxes like on the Cubs and so forth they were a little short but I just designed a little water jet uh, plate that had a standoff on it for my regulator that you had back then so I've got the plate that bolts up with the the induction and then I have a little plate the uh, plate extends on out to the side that I mounted the uh, regulator on. Like and, uh, and just if people, this is not a setup, so Chris just came into the booth. If people want to contact Chris to, directly to get more information on his O200, do you have an email you'd want to share? Oh, yeah. Yes, it's, it's uh, my business. I'm an electrical contractor. It's Chris, C H R I S, at mayelectric.biz. B I Z. Fantastic, Chris. Well, here's to another 650 yep. hours. Yep, I've built uh, five different airplanes over the years or restored them. I'm also at this point an AMP mechanic but highly recommend your TBI. Wonderful. Okay, thanks for that, Chris. Cheers. Good deal.